there's a lady down the street. I mean, well, if it's free, I'm, that's totally up to you. Don't yeah. Worry. I think you left a note on my door telling me to rake my leaves. Although I've been spiteful ever since. So. Sounds good, man. Appreciate you. Thanks. Yep. No Hey, this is Justin from The Blessing Boys, and we have an incredible video for you today. We were contacted by the city to take a look at this overgrown yard. It's recently received some complaints from the neighbors. Not only was the house almost non-visible from the front side, it had a massive amount of trees and vines, which had become to, they began to grow over the roof. And now if these aren't removed, they'll eventually begin to rot through the roof and cause some major damage. So we have our work cut out for us on this one. During this yard, I was actually cutting a tree that I didn't realize had a lot of pressure on the other end from the vines and I got hit pretty bad right in the face. It actually took me about six days before I could return to this job. So hang around to see that if you're okay watching injuries like that and definitely stick around to see the end result and the neighbor's reaction. Hey, subscribe or follow if you haven't already and let's get right into this yard. I didn't realize till I got back in here. Have you guys ever seen vines this thick? I mean, look at some of these things. These are vines just overtaking this house. Yeah, but we're gonna try to go right down the line, the fence line here. We are gonna leave some of the stuff on the fence line for privacy in between his and the neighbor's yard, but we're gonna go down and cut and get these vines up off the house. It's just not good for the roof. But yeah, just thought, whew, never This is crazy, what do we get ourselves into? <laughs> Guys, I don't, I don't think it was on camera, but that's the reason that you wear safety glasses. Thank the Lord I was. There's, I was cutting a branch and there's a little pressure on it and slung back, hit me. Luckily I had my safety glasses on so it didn't get my eyes, but it busted. I can't see it yet to see if I'll need stitches or not yet, but it busted my eyebrow open, busted the bridge of my nose. Got me good, guys. 
So we may call it quits for today while this thing heals and then uh, hit back at it. We're gonna make this look nice. We're not gonna let that put us down. We'll get it done. All right, so we are back. I know it's the next, very next clip, but it's actually been six days since we've been back at this job. I'm nice and healed up, got a nice shiner black eye cuts healed we're back on the job got some better protection so I don't get whacked in the face again since we're doing a lot of cutting um, we're gonna get back into this hopefully finish up this job today I think it's gonna look super good when we're all finished so hang in tight hang in there and we'll get right into this job We're getting ready to head out. Well, Nothing I don't finds. understand why the city hasn't done something way before now. Yeah. Honestly. But nice. Thanks. That yeah. was really good. Yeah, it's Absolutely. a world of difference. I sent my daughter a picture and she was like, there's a house over there. So That's right. Cool. Nice. All right. Well, you Thanks. take care. Have a good one. You too. 